It's a pleasure meeting both of you. Uh, Thank you. Kid. If you were both to give up acting right today and you started becoming a pro professional magician, what would be your stage name? Tracy Bellevue. Oh, I like that. That's a good one. Yeah. Is that your? You know that whole that thing. Is that your porn name? You're supposed yeah. To, yeah, yeah. Mine, your mine is what your... mine. Seymour Twenty Fourth. <laughs> Would it be the number? 24th Street. <laughs> of course. <laughs> if one, Seymour 24. That's kind of nice. That's actually kind of good. Nice. Seymour 24. Yeah. yeah, yeah it's better. Get rid of that. It's way better. Get, get, <laughs> if, ditch the, 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 that'd be the first yeah, thing they'd tell you. Yeah. If, uh, if you could saw uh, a person in half in this world, who would it be? Saw him in half? Huh. Who would you saw in half? I don't know. I don't want to sell anyone. <laughs> that would be really gnarly. Yeah, that seems like a gory. It just would take thing. a long time, I think. You'd yeah, just be there going for on, a long time. Yeah. The parts would be screaming and stuff like that, yeah, too. They, that they, just, they gotta be making then, noise. They're not gonna be quiet. They're not gonna be quiet when they're being sawed in half. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. If uh, if you had the ability to hypnotize somebody or anyone. What would you do? What wouldn't you do is really the question. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You go as far as you can go. You go anything. Yeah, anything absolutely. goes. You put them in traffic naked. Or <laughs> yeah, just... yeah. Is that the first thing that comes to mind? Put them in traffic naked? <laughs> that was, yeah, apparently. I mean, the first thing that came to mind. Put them out in the middle of the street. Yeah. You know, like 45th and Broadway. <laughs> just, just totally messing them up. Yeah. In your opinion, what makes a great magician? Honest trustability. <laughs> I think uh, someone who can pull off their tricks that helps. Yeah. 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 <laughs> right. <laughs> that's a good. That's a good start. Right. Right. So I just apologize all the time. Sorry, this just didn't go right. Oh God, that that'd be actually a funny oh, bit. No, no, there is a guy who used to do that. English guy, <laughs> and he just kept blowing it. Kept blowing it, and, uh, and then occasionally you stumble on then, doing no, one. No, sometimes he does great. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> on set uh, with you and your co-stars, who was the best or slash worst at doing card tricks? Yeah, the best would be you and well, Dave. Dave, Dave was pretty Dave Franco great. was pretty great. Yeah, yeah. I'm probably the worst. I, I had the least amount of practice doing it. Well, that wasn't really your, you know, that wasn't Shtick. your thing. No, no. So no. I'm not even thinking about it. You're right. You're right. <laughs> I'm not going to do that. And my last question, I, I've actually asked you this question before, and your answer was "Blister in the Sun." What is your go-to karaoke song, and is that still your answer? I'd have to say yes. Some <laughs> things never change. <laughs> Blister in the Sun. That's a good one. It's pretty good, right? Uh, I would go with, uh, Taxman's taking all my dough. What's that one? That's, uh, Taxman. <laughs> Taxman, that's the Beatles. <laughs> no, what is that song? La, it, it is a Beatles. Sunny, Sunny Afternoon. Sunny Afternoon, the Kinks. Perfect. I was going to think, I Pleasure thought Touch Me Kinks. would be a good one for you. <laughs> Touch Me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>